Hi, I'm Brad Scott. I take care of our freshmen. Transition from high school to college, that's a big event. If it's not for them, it definitely is for the moms and dads, that's for sure. Each year on report day, uh, freshmen and their families come in and we begin what turns out to be a really long first week. We got the freshmen moving in today. Good to see all the families and getting your roommate today. See them merge, you know, nothing like that. Find out who can cook and who can't. Coming a true family, man. It's just been a blessing to see these guys already. I'm Keith McGuire from uh, Brother of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Stay day one, we're moving in right now. I got here before Brian, so I got first pick of the bedroom. Just moving in here at Clemson. Got a little help right here. Hey. Got a little help moving in. We in here. Big muscles right there. I need all the help I can get. Little brother with the shoes. Looking forward to having a good time with my roommate Keith. Let's get to it. Moving in our son, Hamp Green. We're from Birmingham, Alabama. We're so excited as a mom. Oh my gosh. I just walked in and was like, I just want to cry. But I know that this is the best place for him and he's so excited and I love the culture here. I love our coaches. I love all the parents and the team. I'm Heidi Allen. I'm Davis Allen's mom. We're from Calhoun, Georgia. It's bittersweet. We're going to miss Davis. He's our last child, so we're about to be empty nesters. We are super excited about the program. Couldn't ask for a better coaching staff, a more top-notch football program, so we are all in. Hey guys, it's Kirk Herbstreet. Big day for the uh, the Herbstreet family. Take my analyst hat off, just being a dad, which is what I always am. We're moving our, our twins, Jake and Ty, in to, to Clemson today. Mixed emotions because you're excited and almost look at this as a, as a true blessing to have an opportunity for them to go to a school like Clemson and play for Davo Sweeney and, and for this amazing staff and the culture that they've been able to create here. And that, to me, was the most attractive thing as just a dad. I've seen every program in the country, and when my twins decided that they wanted to play at the next level, this was a place that I thought was a great fit because of the things that I've seen. It's here, it's reality. Now we're unloading a truck and moving them in and it's go time. Yeah, getting the boys moved in, baby. Get them moved in. From there, it's a pretty busy Monday. They start on the university orientation, just like all the other students that are coming to Clemson. Walking to orientation, the guys had their first night staying in Clemson. What'd y'all think? It was great, man. <laughs> it was pretty good, great night, excited to get started. Happy for orientation, fellas. And that's where they'll meet their faculty advisors, they'll get with their majors, go through a lot of the fun events that uh, orientations has set up. Hi, my name's Matt Lombardi. I'm the Director of Football Academic Services here at Clemson. So over the course of this first week, we've already gone through campus orientation to go through what the expectations of a Clemson student are and to register for their fall classes. And hopefully by the end of the week, everybody knows where to go, how to get there, but most importantly, why we're here, and that's just to help them throughout their entire time in college. If they ever have a question who they're supposed to see and for the football guys that's myself and Luke Fieser here in the Neary Center we're excited to get this new class going. While the rest of the students have the afternoon all players get to come back here and we have a football orientation that rolls for the next uh, three or four days as well. Fun things that they like, coat and tie pictures for the press guide and the jumbotron and get fitted for their equipment they love that part of it. One part of the freshman orientation is the equipment size sheet. So what we do here is we bring in all the new freshmen and we get them all their apparel, their sizing needs. Uh, so we got to take care of them, get all their swag, get them looking right for the season. Meetings that will include our strength staff, Paul Journey. Earlier today we had the opportunity to kind of break up a really information heavy day and spend some time with our summer entries. We had them communicate something about themselves in a way that maybe they hadn't considered before but are certainly familiar with. We had them create a hashtag to really tell us something about themselves, their goals for the year, their ambitions, and then really let them kind of public speak and get that practice in and share that with the group and then how we can empower them to be accountable for their ambitions for the year. Tonight is the first night of our new student athlete immersion program. Day one of a four day training session we have with all of our new student athletes that covers everything from classroom expectations, where do you go, how do you communicate with us, where do you get your books, how do you do your study hall time, where do you check in for your tutors, basically every bit of information that all of our student athletes are going to need to know. Just a crash course on what it's like to be a student athlete here at Clemson. And then bright and early the next morning and they start in the weight room at 6.15. And we out here walking to class right now. First class of the semester. 21 4.0s right now.
So it's just a really, really busy it's week. one of the best groups that uh, we brought into Clemson. They're fine young men. There's 21 that reported Sunday. What's up? My name's Davis Allen. I'm from Calhoun, Georgia. I play tight end. I'm Michael Dukes, Charleston, South Carolina. Play running back on the football team. My name's Kane Patterson from Nashville, Tennessee. I'm a linebacker. What's good, Tiger Nation? It's Jalen Phillips, Lawrenceville, Georgia, DB, number 25. Hold up. Y'all already know I'm with my boy. Family, what's going on? This is Andrew Booth, Decula, Georgia. I'm Brighton Constantine from Baton Rouge, Louisiana. I play linebacker. I'm Mason Trotter from Spartanburg, South Carolina. I play offensive line. Hello, Tigers. I'm Greg Williams, linebacker, Swanson, South Carolina. My name's Taquan Johnson. I'm from Williamsport, Maryland. I play defensive line, D tackle. Oh, man, what's up, everyone? I'm Levante Bentley from Birmingham, Alabama. I play linebacker. I keep McGuire. I'm from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. I'm Chez. I play running back. I'm from Naples, Florida. Jake Herb Street in Nashville, Tennessee. Cornerback. I'm Ty Herb Street. I'm a wide receiver. I'm from Nashville. Tennessee. This is Matt Cranford from Hartford, South Carolina. I play offensive line. Hemp Green from Birmingham, Alabama. I'm a receiver. I'm Matthew Maloney and I play linebacker. I'm from here, Clemson, South Carolina. Nick Edis here, defensive tackle from Lawrence, Kansas. Transfer here, actually. My name's Hampton Earl, Clemson, South Carolina. I play receiver. David Cody, I play linebacker from Six Mile, South Carolina. I'm Jonathan White from Charleston, South Carolina, place kicker. I chose Clemson because of the family environment. Coach Winnie's real. He gives it to you real. He's an honest man. He wants the best for you. The reason why I chose Clemson was the family atmosphere. Man, it's just different. They treat you like family here. And the opportunities, man, the family. Ain't no better head coach. It was the place for me. And it's a great atmosphere. Everybody to welcome you in with open arms. When you come in, like they're your family, your best friends. They welcomed me. Made me feel really at home. It's a great town. Everybody's nice here. Marvelous academic institution. My favorite part so far has been practicing with the varsity team. Getting into lifting. It's been an awesome time. Getting to know all these guys. Working with my brothers. Trying to get better. Now we're going to come out here. We're going to cherish these moments and we're going to get the job done. Go Tigers. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs>